Make sure you get in the ground first, right? I want you to really start thinking about being more linear. So we can't, we can't just be here to here, right? 82.3 there. We're gonna be, once you set that angle, you have to get keep that angle into the ground. You understand what I'm saying? It's gotta be two paces to your windup. You gotta gather and then maintain, right? Instead of, it can't just be me gathering and then like supermaning myself to home plate. It's gotta be, I gather and then I maintain that angle till I hit, then I go. Does that make sense? Yeah. Because then you can use all this stuff, right? Okay, you're nine foot 13, you gotta use all that stuff. Seventy-eight point two. Separate and push the back hip. So we need the push to come from your back hip, not from your upper body. Right? Leave your upper body out of it. Once you decide to go, man, it's this doesn't move anymore. Okay. Seventy-nine point nine. Give me a high three-quarter slot. Couple more. 79.5, okay? Stride out a little further, push the back hip into your stride. Use that same slot. Okay, 79 point, 81.4, okay? One more. Push out a little further. There it is, very nice, James. James, that's where it's gotta be, man. It's gotta be, it's gotta be here. Okay, go ahead and hook in. 81.2. I mean, a guy that can run it back, if you can learn, like you did last year a few times, if you can learn to run that thing back opposite side and have it come back, you can win the mental game, you know? As a right-handed hitter facing a right-handed pitcher that's here, if I know, or anywhere, a right, righty on righty, if you can throw the baseball to the opposite side with plane, me as a, as a same side hitter, can't, I can't do anything with that. So the fact that you can execute that makes you very dangerous to me. And I'm going to be more likely to take chances and try and cheat on the pitch and have to get swings at bad breaking balls or whatever. So I'm trying to cheat because I have no interest in getting to two strikes. You what I'm saying? Yeah. So you being able to say Paul, man, and get out to own people. Okay? Okay, here we go. So take that extra tension you've got now and push the back hip in. Stay on top of the hip. Land and then go. 82.1. Land and then go. Push the back hip, not the upper body. Push. See, do you see how your back leg, when you throw, it's like, yeah, that's why I got a lower number. So it's like 80.1 there. So it's like you hit and then you throw and your leg's just kind of going. You need to get it to where your leg is flying around. And the way to do that is to take this thing and hammer it through one. Okay? Fast and hard into the ground, and then fast and hard through with the back hip. Go. Come on. Good. 82.8. Push, push, push. Push. There it is. Very nice, James. See, so your hand... Like Thomas should hear your hand accelerate out there. No one else should be able to hear it earlier. Alex should hear your hand accelerate out there, but not until then. Oh. This should be your hip. It should be, right? Okay, 82.8. One more. Put it on. Push. Okay, go ahead and take that thing off. That's a good pitch right there. Good down there. Yep, 79.9. Okay, so now... We're gonna keep that explosion and hammer through it. We're gonna finish up, throw five more. You're gonna keep that explosion. You need to hear your front foot slam into the ground. Okay. Push. Good, James. I want you to try, I want you to make it a goal. Yeah, point four, good. I want you to make it a goal to get out to here when you let go. So where we're gonna do that is not with this or this, it's gonna be with this and this. See, I'm gonna unlock this bad boy right here. When I hit, I'm gonna unlock this, boom, and go. And that's where my fastball happens. 
Yeah. Right? Okay. Good, man. It's a good drop down a hair for me. Drop down just a hair. Push the back hip, 79.2 there. Push. It's so much more loose and athletic. James, you gotta stay down there. It's so much better from right there. I'm telling you what, good. That's so, I, I mean, I know that's not the number you're looking for, but that's such a better quality pitch, you know? Go ahead and s just sit out there, Juan. Two more, set up outside, yep. Push hard with the back hip, push. Try even harder to get that front foot to slam into the ground. You should hear it. 80.7. Two more. I want, you to, I want you to drop a little bit more. Yeah. Push. Go. So when I so the thing is when you do that, you can't also compensate this way. So it can't you can't treat your upper body like you're throwing here. Mm -hmm. You have to stay tall here. See what I'm saying? Like you're throwing from behind the plate. You land, everything stays tall. And I go. Right? Yeah. Reach out. There we go. Good. We'll do one more. Last one right here. That was better. Yep. Eighty point six. Good. What's that? Yeah. 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 And go. It's good, man. It's free and easy with loose late sink. So I mean, yeah, 81. So I mean you picked up a couple with it on and then you're 80-81 with it off. The more you can get